much for all of your messages on that. Uh, now, it is the TV show that has got so many people gripped, but after three seasons, Happy Valley comes to an end on Sunday night. Will it be a not-so-happy valley for Ryan and Tommy Lee Royce? Can Catherine escape to the Himalayas and will she heal the rift with her sister Claire? Well, joining us now to discuss all of that and more is Izzy Suti, who's actress, comedian and also hosts the official Happy Valley podcast. Got to say, there will not be any spoilers at no. all. We've got to give the people a heads up. So, look, I, I've got a confession, Izzy. I haven't watched a single episode of Happy <laughs> Valley. So, <laughs> tell me, tell us about it. No, no, no. It's, it's coming to an end that I know that people are going to be devastated by this. It's been such a huge hit. It has. And do you know what? When I got offered this podcast, I just... It was like a gift in my lap because I am a massive fan of the show, like so many people. And I didn't realise there are people who, who I didn't know watched it who'd been texting me going, tell me what happens at the end, tell me. And I'm like, I can't, I'm sorry, I can't. But it's you've just it. brilliant. We've had to watch all of them because um, the podcast comes out straight after the show. But I can honestly say the last episode is brilliant and you're in for such a treat if i were you i'd watch all <laughs> three I, series you know what? this is the first time. i'm going to say this out loud i'm supposed to like read up on everything i haven't read it up on this because i want to go in fresh you I know would. i don't, don't, don't want to i don't want to know too it. much <laughs> Uh, yeah. OK, well, I've seen both the previous series and I'm completely up to date with this one. And yes, we must not say anything about what actually happens in the last episode. But I do want to ask you about something else, which is there's a suggestion that people have been going to that area of Yorkshire because they've been drawn in by the show. Now, there are some beautiful shots of Yorkshire, but you've got to say, it's pretty menacing as well at times. Is this really going to bring people in to, to have a look around? Well, there are these beautiful wide shots, aren't there, of the valleys and the hills. <laughs> and I was thinking, especially when Tommy goes up on the bike, mm. it's this beautiful shot of him, mm. you know, taking in the air and he's, he's free. Um, I know what you mean. I mean, there is the sort of underbelly to the place, but for me, that would make me want to go in. I want to go and look at all the locations. So, I've got to say, I did watch one clip. It was Sarah Lancashire and... Um, um, I have to say, the acting it was, it was pretty grim. She got, you know, beaten quite badly, <laughs> which probably put me off. However, the acting, absolutely incredible. It is incredible. It's so well cast. We were lucky enough to talk to a few cast members and, you know, mm. it... It honestly is. I mean, writing's so tight. There's mm. nothing in there that's just filler. You have to. I think you have to work quite hard as an audience member. I don't know if you agree. You can't just sit back and watch it. I know you don't want to miss a moment. You can't nip um, out and get a cup of tea or something. No, you really can't. Mm. There'll be a name that's thrown out there that you have to remember for a couple of episodes later. Mm. But the acting is brilliant, and the bond between the two main characters, Catherine and Claire, I think is the beating heart of the show. Mm. And I think we should have a shout out for the writer Sally Wainwright, who's uh, written all three series and has done an absolutely brilliant job. So, in a nutshell, everyone should watch on Sunday night. Absolutely. What I would say to you is it will move you, you will cry, you will laugh. It's very funny as well in a kind of dry way and it's mm. just brilliant. I've got to say, I'm looking for a box set. I'm going to give it a go. Okay. It sounds amazing. Izzy Suti, thanks very much for coming no in. No worries. Thank you. Yeah. OK, we're going to take a short break now, but in a few minutes. Uh, the mysterious Chinese balloon that's been flying over America. Find out what it is. And...